Hello everyone, my name is Robert Rewind, and welcome back to the game One Shot, as we hear uh, where we left off, Nico is already talking to us. Robert Rewind? Uh, how, how do you play this game? I, uh, uh, there goes space. Robert Rewind, can you hear me? Yeah. Oh. Whew. What happened? Everything went pitch black for a second. Oh, they're talking about when I close out the game. Oh no. Okay. Uh, let's continue on. We, we have just arrived in the Glen. So, um... Was it, was it shift to run? Yeah. So we are now in the Glen here. Uh, I don't know what we're supposed to be doing. I think we're supposed to be... Oh, there's a person there. Uh, yeah, let's go back. Let's go back real quick. Oh, there's like little bird peoples around. Mm-hmm. Nothing biting. Cool. There's a little ru runny root. Hello. I'm catching fireflies for my mommy. Okay, good for you. Let's go back inside the building and see what we have. The game seems to be running a lot better now, for whatever reason. These are f filled with small dried fish. There was once a time where people used to live in these ruins. But due to flooding, most of us have moved to less permanent settlements. Flooding? Aye, the land has gotten brittle. The Glen used to be in one piece, you know, but now it's just a bunch of islands that get smaller and smaller. Ah. Empty jar. A fish stew. Alright, nothing in here then. I thought we had to talk to them. Uh, let's head upwards on this little bridgey brew. Hello, my name is Nico, and I, uh, this guy named Robert Rewind speaks to me. What's up, dude? Most of the green moss covering our village has already lost its glow. If it wasn't for the thin strip letting the boundaries of the land, people could easily fall into the ocean. Without light, land and water become indistinguishable here. Eh, I wouldn't say indistinguishable, you, you can still kind of hear it. The jar is full, okay, the jar is full of dry beans. Alright, I ring rang. There's a little dude here. Whoop. Didn't mean to do that. Woo! Is that the sun? Yeah. And you're holding it? Isn't it hot? Not really. It's nice and warm. They appear to be aware. What if I ring all these little bells? Well, there's a lot of bells. Yeah, no. Um, let's go touch this guy in the blue. The land is fragmenting at alarming rates. I don't like to think, of, think about the day that, the, that this town finally loses to the intruding sea. But to find another place to settle. Yeah, something tells me that I don't know, I don't think this little sun could uh, fix, you know, fix this uh, world. There seems to be a lot of other problems as well. The crops have been growing poorly without the sun. There's no telling how long our surpluses will last. Please, Savior, you have to hurry. I, I'll do my best. Yeah, uh, sorry, Nico. Um, this world seems to be more than just gone with the sun. Look at this little sheep. He's freaking out. Dang, what's this guy on? Hell yeah, I'm gonna name this little sheepo, uh, uh, um, uh, Crag. All right, Crag, you you do that. All right. Hello. Hmm. I need someone. To herd my rams. Oh, I could do that. I see grown-ups do back home. You know, you, you know, you just kind of push them around. Hmm. But you are carrying the sun. Ah. Wait, can't you just watch the sun? I cannot. I am but a simple shepherd. Um. Okay. Come back when your hands are free, and you reward will reward if you can herd my rams. Okay. So we gotta drop the sun off. What in the ocean? How's that? You could break the sun. I got an achievement for that. For trying to break the sun on accident. Ring room. Oh, this person actually... Hello. Hey ya. You, oh, you look like a trader. Hey ya. You here to trade? Trade? Yeah. Is there something you want to get rid of? Make me an offer and I'll give you something in return. Hmm. Do we have something like that, Robert Rewind? I have no idea. We have a strange journal, an amber, a light bulb. I don't know if we need that. Huh. There's like a bunch of... Oh, I guess this is so people don't fall into, like, the water. They're 
appears to be a place here. Okay, nothing. Huh, I don't know what we're doing. I am what you would say, a bit lost. What's up, dude? The flood can't take away our farmlands, but it can't take away our fish. Actually, it gives you fish in return. Or, yeah, we'll say that. It gives you fish in return, sure. Let's be optimistic about it. Okay. This place looks creepy. Doorway is full of vines, Rapper Rewind. Ah. Do we need to cut them? Or... Oh, wait. Can't I just put away the sun? No. I, I now I have the sun in utilize mode. Let's go talk to this little sheep. What's up, little sheepo? Yeah. Oh, my God. Craig, you look, sound scary as hell. Yeah. See that? See, George is cool. Yeah. So is Steve. Yeah. So does Calvin. Yeah. Becky. But no, no, not, not, not this guy. Not, not this guy. This guy is all like... Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Well, moving on. With little sh moving away from the sheep that's totally tripping out. Hello. What am I supposed to do here? Move. Please. Okay. Uh, I am very lost. I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, what about this? What, is this sheep going to be crazy too? This ram is chewing on a ball of moss. Now I'm curious. What do you think it tastes like? Mmm. Gum. The moss, not the ram. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah. The life in these lands what to do for now. I'm starting to see very small spirits. It'll probably take some time for these to bear fruit. Cause I like small sprouts. I gotta be careful I don't step on these. It doesn't even let me step on them. Okay. All right. Let's draw attention to one of these buildings. I can't enter into that one. Daddy says the world is very sick, but Robert Rewind can make it better again. Are you Robert Rewind? Um, not really. I'm just the Messiah. Makes sense. I can talk with Robert Rewind, though. Wow! What's it like? Really cool. Aw, thanks, Nico. You're the best. Okay, now we're having those little lag issues. I don't know what it is. Okay. Well... I am what you would call lost. Well, look, the black clovers. Just like we have in our little amber. Oh, what if I had to trade the amber? But that belongs to silver. Alula? Alula! Where'd you go? Rubbery Wang, did you hear that? Alula! I think it's coming from the southeast of here. Southeast, southeast. Southeast. Oh, that's a yawn. What? Hey, you there? Have you seen a, a little? Have you seen a little girl? She seems a bit shorter than you. And wait, that's the sun. Are you our savior? Uh, uh, yeah. Oh my stars! Sorry for my rudeness. Huh? It's all right. But are you looking for someone? My little sister. She's been gone for three days now. Wow. I've been looking all over, but what does she look like? Um, a bit shorter than you. Long blue hair, two blue feather heads on top of her head. I'm, I'm sorry, I haven't seen anyone like that. When was the last place you saw her? Back inside the ruins. She said she was heading towards the forest, so I'm waiting for her now. But I ran out of places to look. Okay, so we gotta find Alula. Alula, where you at? Your sibling. Desires. Missing you. He's looking for you. Alright, okay, we can't go through there. This giant robot. <clears throat> I have to get this this um this voice right. The sun. You're the messiah. 
Are you on your way to the tower? Um, you can enter the refuge through this wall. But you'll need to sign your name in the scroll first. Oh, all right. Uh, do you have a pen? Um, no, I've lost mine. Perhaps you should look around the Glen for another. Wow, you are an amazing robot. Er, robot. So we gotta find a son. Oh no, we, we have a son. We gotta find a pen and a lost child. What is this? Hello, person. Please note that the ruins are below, are partially flooded. Oh, should we not be here? This, there is no immediate danger. Using this area as a dwelling is not recommended, however. All right, cool. Well, do not dwell in here too long. Do not take up residence. A cluster of vines are blocking the way. Yeah. What are those weird cubey things? That's what these little cubes are reminding me of. Where are we? Have we traveled through space and time? Oh, there's a computer. Oh, these trippy computer dude. No, he's weird. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, please stop that. My entire background just changed. My uh, the entire background over here. No, I like my background. Change it back. Okay, just getting the voice. Hello again, Robert Rewind. It seems I need to help you again. Nico would not be able to progress otherwise. This time, the information you need has fallen to the most easily accessible place on your machine. Do you see it? No. Oh! Whoa! Okay, okay, so I moved my, um... You can't see it, so I have my little record... Oh, wow, wow, Inception there. <laughs> no, um, so I have my recordings on the, uh, my, oh, my other thing on the other side here. Yeah, look, there it is! See? And it replaces it. Yes. You know what to do with it, then. Okay, 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 so let me show you what it looks like. This, there's, I have, like, a little pattern here on the back. I still, okay, it's, it looks cool. But I still kind of like my my little like other thing. When did I get to change my back? Cause I think that was a stock one. All right. Please don't do that. That's creepy. All right. Um. Uh, hello. This looks. This place looks a little bit special. So now I have a creepy background. Ah. These vines appeared minutes ago. Really? I've seen a lot of them just in doorways and stuff. I assume this because this place was abandoned. A sign of distress. Huh? A living being is in need of help. I, but I cannot trace the source. Ah. Okay, so someone needs help. Okay, good. I was, I was really hoping that this connected at the very end. Oh, there's a robo there. Hello, robo. Hello, person. Two children residing near here. Really? Uh, okay, you can't walk that way. My background's all weird again, still. I like this. Hello, my name is Rubber Rewind. Oh! I can't believe it. You're... you're real. Uh, uh miss? Are, are, are you alright? No. We should get you to the village. Maybe they could... It, it's okay. It's okay. Too late for me. But... the sun... I haven't seen it. I haven't felt it in so long. Savior... If it's not too much trouble, can you lend me the sun for a while? Uh, I... W will it make you better? No, it will not save me. I just want to experience the sun one more time before, well... Um, would it be too selfish for me to 
me to ask? Okay, um, so there's like all this like viney vine stuff around, but she looks like a plant lady, and even though like everything's telling me don't do this, but I did try to smash the sun earlier in a previous episode, so um, I mean, I guess <laughs> I'll leave it with her with this person. And so far everybody seems to be okay in this game, so what should I do, Robert Rewind? We'll give it the sun. We should we should do that. Sure. Here. Warm. I have almost forgotten. It's so warm. That's good, right? The the vine should be gone now. I'm not afraid anymore. So we'll just leave I guess we'll just leave a little Wait! Are we using my life essence right now to like in the previous episode I I said that? You know that and since like Nico's eyes are yellow and everything You know, is it like basically Nico's life being absorbed by the sun? Or, you know, like the sun is feeding off of Nico's life. Okay, so now these guys. What was yours? Yes. The vines have receded. Do you know what happened? I found this plant person. She was barely holding on. I gave her the sun for now, but she said it's too late for her. I understand. I need to report this to the city. Oh! We're over here now. Or, are we in the same place I think we are? Um, yeah, we're back here. Let's see. I don't think it's right to trade this way. Oh, hey, you have one of those toy things. I dug up a couple of these before. Oh, yeah. There's this guy who would trade me for the best thing. Oh, wait, his, his voice, I'm sorry. Oh, like this one time, he brought me this little machine that plays music. I don't know what it's called, but you have to wind it up. A music box? That's it! I wish that guy would come back soon. I haven't seen him in forever. I want to do more trades with him. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so now we don't have the uh, sun anymore. So we could go do this thing over here. We have the creepy, we have the creepy ass, weird chipping goat. Calvin was his name. I see your hands are free now. Would you like to help me herd my rams? There's a great reward in store for you, I promise. Yes. Excellent. So the south is a peninsula that inhabits my rams. They're all saying that unfortunate spots you need to move into the darker box. If you get stuck, ring a bell and they'll all return to their original positions. Good luck. Okay, so they're talking about this thing here. Okay, so I have to try to... Oh, damn it. <laughs> I messed that up already. Okay. Great. I have no idea what happened there, okay? Um, you provided a great service for all ram kind. In return, take this fine ram wool. Um, thanks. Wool, it's kind of useless. <laughs> okay. Can we go trade that? Now this guy's still freaking out. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Hey, yeah. You here to trade? Trade. Oh. You want to trade this wool? I think I have something you like to trade. You take wool, right? You, what can I get? What can this wool get me? Wool, huh? That'll get you this fine vial of. I'm not sure what the thing is actually. It's some sort of fabric dye. How about it? Sure. I'll do it. Oh, I I'll do it. Pleasure doing business with you. Bottle dye, a small vial filled with dark blue liquid used for dyeing wool. Well, damn it, we just got the wool. Can we, like, steal it back? Okay, um... Now since we got that, we should go talk to Plant Lady. Or, maybe not talk. The ground seems to be a lot darker now. 
So we're probably just gonna go see our dad. But you know, just gonna check out what's happening. The light bulb is out. Oh no. Oh, she's still here. Oh, okay. Well. Well, well, we're here, so we might as well talk to her. I'm not afraid anymore. Thank you. I uh, probably shouldn't pick that up. That's bad. Okay. Okay. Oh, we have a... We have ink. What do we have? Okay, we have that. We have ink now. So now we can try to write our name. We can, we need a feather. That's what we need now. Where am I? Now there's also that other thing that the computer was going all fourth wall on me again. And I don't know where to do this. Still haven't, oh, how was it, what was the voice? Still haven't figured it out. You remember the document, correct? This time, it's even more obvious. What's the most easily- Oh, I already know this part. Yeah, I know. Bye, Waymo. You like messed up my- You didn't mess it up, but you just changed my background. That was an ugly purple color. Oh, wait, can I go into like that other place now? Oh, wait, no, this was the other place. Huh. Oh, oh, here, is this, is this what I think it is? Yes, yeah, this is exactly what I think it is. Okay, what was it? So we gotta find, okay. I'll try to put this. Okay, actually I could just, I could leave that there and I have the, the pattern on my other screen over here. Okay, let's do it like that. Okay, let's try this. There you go. Okay, let's see how I could do this. These three, these three. Oh, wait, what? There we go. All right, what happens now? Oh! You saved me! Hey, my background changed! Back. You saved me! Thank you! Oh, that's a little bit tight. I was trapped in there for so long. So, you are Alula. Oh, this is a little girl, right. You knew my name? Wow, the Messiah really does know everything. Oh, look, they're all happy. Actually, I just met your brother earlier. Oh, right. Gosh, Calmus must be so worried. Can you bring me to him? Are you following me now? Or what's up? Wait a minute. How did you know that I was the uh, Messiah? I don't even have the sun with me. Your eyes. Huh? They reminded me of the sun. Oh, that's why you're a Messiah, right? Well, I, uh, a, bit, a lot of people back in my home world have eyes like mine. Homeworld? Yeah. I'm, I'm actually from another world. You you, you see? It's a place where the sun is in the sky and not a tower. Do you like this world too? I, uh, yeah. Yay! Calmus keeps saying that this world is going to get more dangerous by the minute. Oh. But that's okay. You're here now. You can make everything better. Oh, kid, no. Yeah. Are you following me now? Yep. What's in here? You were just stuck in this like little place here? Okay, I can't I can't even talk to them. Alright. Let's go. Oh, I guess this is where I get the feather so I can get a pen so I can um so I can get a pen so I can write my name in and into the temple. Uh eh, but I need to get the the uh, the sun first. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, 
We'll be back, Mr. Robot Dude. I think this is the right way. Oh man, this kid thinks that we could save the world. Camus! Alula! You're okay. Oh, yeah, this is the brother, so I could. You're okay. Thank goodness. I was trapped in the room and it was really scary. But then the Messiah saved me. Trapped? In the ruins? Yeah! There was a uh, weird stuff in the door. You know, the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometimes? The stuff you told me to stay away from? What? It's spread to the ruins now? This isn't good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still, if it gets any worse, you might have to find somewhere else to live. What? What this square stuff exactly? Bad. Anything that touches them just kind of sort of gets messed up. Whenever you hear people saying the world is decaying, that's what they meant. Obviously, you should avoid them too. I will. Anyway, uh, I can't thank you enough for rescuing my sister, Savior. Just call me Nico. Oh gosh, would it be rude to me for me not to call you by your name? Huh? What would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. Ah, well then, we'd like to visit our house, Nico. Sure, why not? Let's go see what's up. Yay! Let's go. Oh, the little sister's so spry. It's amazing. Ah, okay. Oh shoot. Looks like we can't get past that block. Huh? Oh, just the little block. Um, uh, fourth wall breaking. Seriously? I'll be up ahead. <laughs> Nico. <laughs> I literally have never thought of that. You know, you kind of get used to the uh, uh, Derby's living here after a while. Come on, our house isn't too far from here. What, what's going to happen? Oh, nothing. Okay. So, uh, welcome to our house. Yeah, I know it isn't much, but, uh, feel free to make yourself comfortable. Ah, there it is. Here, we want you to have this. Ooh. Nice. We got a little feather. Oh, a feather. The edges are glowing yellow. It's a sacred feather from the great prophet. Oh? Yeah. She's this old lady that our dad used to know. Her feathers can glow in the dark, and she can see into the future. What? Or something like that. <laughs> she gave us one of my feathers before she... She gave one of her feathers to my father before she died. My father wanted to pass it down as an heirloom, although it feels more fitting for you to have it. Are, are you sure? Totally sure. I think that's what our father would want. Have wanted. Thank you. Wow. Ooh, they have like little beds and everything. That's cool. It's good to be home again. Oh, uh, by the way, what happened to the sun? I lent to someone in the ruins. She said she wanted to feel the sun. Oh, I, I lent to somebody in the ruins. She said she wanted to feel the sun again before she, uh... Oh, you must be talking about maize. Maize. My that oh, that's like corn! Oh, that's her name? She's this powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the glen. But once the sun died, her health rapidly deteriorated. Oh, I'm glad you were able to find her in time. I think we might be already too late to save her. I know, but I'm glad she. Sh I'm glad she got to see the sun again. Can I like, fall asleep on these beds? It's a bed. Well, more like a mattress. <laughs> okay. Well, unfortunately, I'm about to leave this episode here. So if you've enjoyed this nice little episode, it's very, very, uh, another, another one of these. A gift from friends. There you go. That's the name of this episode right there. So, uh, yeah, that's me in this episode. So thank you all for watching. My name is Robert Roy. Don't forget to watch. And once again, thanks for watching. <laughs>